think that the uh, that China wants its locals to win. We saw, uh, I think, just in this week, Neo. Uh, because of the, the the battery swap system it has, no matter what it's pricing its cars at, it's going to get subsidies, whereas the Model Y will not get subsidies in China. So there is some uh, favoritism for locals, but we... Welcome back, friends, for one more update from the world of EV stocks. In case you're new to this channel, please do consider subscribing. And if you live in the United States, you can get two free shares worth up to $1,850 just by following the link in the description. Now enjoy the rest of the video. Last Friday was a significant event for the NEO stock, as the company made some stunning revelations during the Power Day presentation that day. Not only did we learn that NEO now aims for more battery swap stations by the end of 2021 than previously estimated, we also came to know about the gigantic targets for 2025. According to most top analysts at Wall Street, the new expansion targets have changed the game completely for NEO. Also, in case you guys have forgotten, NEO is just four months away from full-scale production of their sedan ET7. Needless to say, the arrival of the sedan will send NEO sales numbers through the roof. NEO's monthly sales numbers are already on a steady rise, but looking at 2022, we see a total explosion of the numbers for NEO. All that only means that the NEO stock will not be a $40 stock for too long and it's only a matter of time before we see the stock price hit three digits. We're looking at this article that came out today on a popular investment news platform, which claims that the NEO stock is headed back to $67.50 before too long. According to the article, NEO is set to gain traction in Europe. By September, it has plans to open its first service and delivery center in Oslo. Coupled with the growing demand for electric vehicles all over the world, the move could send NEO back to $67.50 really quickly. Better, with the US, Europe, and China pledging to cut emissions over the next several years, they all want millions of electric vehicles on the roads. The author of the article goes on to add, I would use any signs of weakness in the NEO stock as an opportunity to buy more. With strong deliveries and revenue growth likely down the road, European expansion plans and countries demanding electric vehicles, growth isn't likely to slow. From a current price of $45, I'd like to see NEO back up to $67.50, near term, rather easily. 